and you can have a piece on one-handed catches without Randy Moss and without a jugs machine. Hasselback's down there, Rex is down there, firing them at us, and we're gonna ask Randy now what the difference between one-handed and two catches really are. Well, the one thing you always hear is each week talking about the big catch radius from us big wide receivers, uh -huh. Grunk, myself. You know, opposed to a guy using one, uh, opposed to using two. As you can see, using two, as you can see, look where the ball is opposed to where, uh, around my body. Matt, throw me another one. I'm able to separate myself, you know, if it's right. a defender, right. body, and ball. Mm -hmm. So you've seen a lot of these professional athletes, Justin Jefferson last week, Stephon did last week. A lot of people sit up here and wonder, are we practicing it? Yes, we're practicing. How do you think we're going to perfect it? Okay, so now what if I'm a defender? How does that, how do you have the advantage by doing a one-handed catch if I'm a defender over here? So well, I'll be on this side. The one thing, let me, let me use two first. Okay. So as you can see here. Two-handed, I can get yes, this here. I you're able to get the away. ball out. And yeah. if, if I'm expecting to use two hand, I can get the ball out like that. Okay. But now I'm ready to use one where I'm separating myself from defender, body, no ball. I can't reach it. No, you cannot reach, reach the yes. ball. So once again, I'm just going to tell you fans and you viewers, you viewers out Ooh. there, yes, I'm not, we I'm practice this. <laughs> How do you think we perfect this? Yeah. 